Hey guys, my name is Trina. Today we are reviewing Anastasia Beverly Hills Magic Touch Concealer. So if this is your first time here and you want to learn more about makeup, please don't forget to click the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss any beauty video. So this is how the concealer looks like. This is the height, how it is, and it's very fat. It's one of those fat concealers that are trending. I have my phone and it claims it's a medium to full coverage concealer. The formula is lightweight and it corrects, it brightens and blurs and conceals, which is great. So again, it's a medium coverage concealer and it's free of parvins, it's vegan, it's gluten free and cruelty free. It comes in 25 shades and it retails for $29 and it's available at Sephora and Ulta Beauty. Okay, so I primed my face and I applied foundation already off camera to not make this video long. So this is the concealer. And I'm gonna open it to you guys. This is the concealer, how it looks like. And I have mine in the shade 8. I'm going to apply one side with a sponge and one side with a brush so you could, guys can know how well it blends with a brush or with a sponge. So once again, I have this concealer in the shade 8. And again, it has a fat dome. So I'm going to apply it right now. And I'm taking my concealer brush. Okay, so before we continue, I would like to show you guys the difference. So I just finished applying it with my concealer brush. And you can see this is before, no concealer, after, with concealer, with the brush. You see how well I blended it, blended it in motion, circles, how well it blend. Look how it covered my dark circles. See, before dark circles, no dark circles, it covered it. So once again, it's medium covered. Now I'm going to do the same thing on this side. This time with the sponge. This is a damp sponge, by the way. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys the difference. So this side, I had used the brush. And this side, I used the sponge. So please let me know in the comments down below which side 
um did you like did you like the brush or did you like the sponge okay so i'm gonna leave this on for about like a couple of hours and then i'll be right back i am back it is 1 p.m and i filmed this video at 8 a.m in the morning so as you can see it did not crease up on my eyes did not crease it blend perfectly did not move whatsoever through this couple of hours i left it on i just really like it i really like the way that it like glows on them and brightens it did exactly what it claimed as i read it to you uh, earlier i just really like it so much so my honest opinion about this Anastasia Beverly Hills Magic Touch Concealer. It's creamy, it's hydrating, and it really is medium coverage. And I love the fact that it covers my dark circles. So if you are one of those person, one of those people that like suffers from dark circles and you always looking for a concealer that covers it well, I believe this will be the concealer for you. Again, this is the shade 8 and I believe this is like for light to medium skin tones. I'm not really sure but I just chose number 8 and I just really like it. It covered the dark circles. Well, that was my main concern when it comes to concealer. Make sure it covers the dark circles and um this retails remember this retails for 29 dollars 29 dollars i know it sounds a bit pricey but i believe this is a, this is an affordable one because there to be honest with you there are many concealer that cost more than 29 dollars so i believe this is such an affordable price from anastasia for just 29 dollars and i also love the fact that it comes in 25 shades again once again it comes in 25 shades and it's gluten free cruelty free and vegan and it's available at sephora and elta beauty so please get your hands on this concealer while it lasts because i know the shades goes out fast thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this review on this anastasia magic touch concealer if you like this video please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe right here or right here and i'll see you in my next video